All right, what's going on, you guys? Welcome to Real Madrid Hub. I'm your host, Dr. J. And today I will be talking about Taki Kubo and his situation in Getafe, which is not good. Unfortunately, I don't have good news for you guys. Uh, although the good beginning he had in Getafe when he arrived to the um, to the blue team in January, and apparently everything was going okay and everything was going to be completely different to the time he played for Villarreal uh, in the beginning of the season. Now we are going through the same situation than Villarreal when he was playing for Villarreal. Over the last three games, Take Kubo has just played 77 minutes in three different games, which is pretty bad. I mean, it's pretty few, few minutes for him. And it's exactly what we don't want for Take Kubo to happen. I mean, the reason why we canceled the loan with Villarreal and we brought the guy back to Madrid and then redirect him to Get Getafe, it was just because we wanted him to play every single game. And actually, the first game against Elche, he made a great performance. He was all the time assisting, he had some chances to score, he was all the time there running back and forth. I mean, he stole the show, actually. Problem is, right after that, he was, in the, in the next four games, he was as well in the starting 11, but right after that, he, for any reason we don't know, he disappeared. He has barely played 77 minutes in the last three games. I mean, the reason might be, for example, Hetafe has lost these three games, and that pushes to Bordalas to make some changes, and maybe within those changes, Taki Kubo and Alenya as well have been out of the squad, and maybe that is the reason, because Bordalas has to try something new, has to prove or make tactical adjustments or something like that. I don't know, man. Problem is, if you, I mean, from a Real Madrid perspective, that is pretty bad news, because the only reason why we give on loan players is because we want them to play as much as possible. So if we are not getting that from Hetafe either, then I don't know what is the what is going to be the decision from Sinan Zidane. I don't really know what is in his mind. If he wants to bring him back to Real Madrid for the next year or try to give him a loan again to another team where we think that he might have more chances to play, I don't really know. The only thing I can tell you for now is that this situation is not good. It's not good for Taki Kubo. It's not good for Ramadi either. And I honestly don't know what is going to happen. But hopefully we can hear better news in the near future. Maybe from now to the end of the season we can see something different. Because it's better for him. Actually, it's better for him to have more minutes and more chances to play in order to come back to Real Madrid. So now let me know your thoughts about that. Just comment in the section below. And of course, subscribe to this channel, Real Madrid Hub.